today we are trying food at the Christmas market in Oxford. Ho ho ho! We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year's. Mm, very hot. Yeah. So a few bits of the coming together. And we all set up. So we're all like, we go we and I break it a bit. He's French. Huh? He's French. <laughs> <laughs> We are ready. We got a hot dog, and we have some regular churros, and an Oreo brownie, and a ham and cheese crepe. We also got the beautiful views of Oxford. Give it a try and mm. let me know how it is. Got onions in it as well. <laughs> Eat that hot dog. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's got a bit cold. You're just supposed to make that noise. <laughs> mm. Mm. That should be nice. Are you going to try it with onions? Or not? I think I'll leave the onions for you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't think I'm going to try the onions. Out of turn? Um, I'm gonna say seven. Seven out of ten. What mm -hmm. is it missing for the ten? I don't know. It's a strange taste. Maybe you try it. Let's try it. That's a big bite. Thoughts? The bread is too hard. Mm. That's a good point. The onion's nice. It's pretty decently cooked. And the hot dog has a... It's a normal flavor, really. <laughs> but the bread is, is not the best. So, out of ten? Six. Ooh, I was too optimistic. I'll still eat it, though. <laughs> Here we have crepe, ham and cheese, um, brushed with some butter. Now we're gonna try it with the lovely wooden fork and knife, which, oh my gosh, what an experience. I think he folded it in a very strange way, so I don't really know how to eat it. <laughs> you sit it with your like, hands. Yeah, your oh hands. my gosh, I almost dropped the whole thing. Let's just take a bite. She's a bit wild. Let's see the inside. Can't mm. really see much. Probably should have eaten this one first because it's really cold now. <laughs> but the sausage was still warm. Did you get any ham and cheese? Mm -hmm. mm. Out of 10 with the first bite, how much? So when it first touched my mouth, all it right, was all right, Master very Chef. Very strange taste. <laughs> Master Chef? Nothing crazy. Give it another it's one. It's not that special. S see if you Let's can get try deeper. It again. Get deeper. Yeah. There. Big bite here. Um, mm, I don't know. It's also got salt and pepper. I so had better ones, I just have to say it. Mine. Mm. <laughs> Mine are better. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'm gonna have a bite now. I'm out. We're gonna bit, go a bit wilder. Mm. Thoughts? Strange, right? 
I think there's something on the flour. Yeah, maybe the mixture is not. It gives it that taste. And then the cheese is very powerful, and I don't like cheese that much. I'm not even sure I can still eat this. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna give this a three. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> yeah, it's not great. I think I would have given around the same score. So. But I'm hungry, so I might eat it. Disappointed, but it is a Christmas Let's market. Let's look inside. So they do cook it fast, so yeah. Maybe when it was warm, it was nicer, but I it guess we will not now. Five <laughs> fifty for this, so yeah, rip off. Not worth it. Hashtag waste. <laughs> well, um, that was a disaster, but here we have. Maybe this is gonna save the flavor in my mouth. Um, we also, this... It also comes with chocolate. Mm -hmm. Chocolate dip. Try Let's it with try it without the sauce first. Looks a bit oily, but they did fry it in oil, so. Wow, tastes like pure oil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Try with so strict today, Master Chef. No. <laughs> it just tastes of oil. Like, it's. Oh, okay, the texture seems alright. <laughs> Oh, I'm going to dirty myself. How is it? Like hot chocolate? <laughs> and sugar. <laughs> That's Strange. what it basically is. Mm. That one's max. Out of 10? Oh. Um, 4 or 5. Oh, very I'm hungry. Very I'm hungry. Straight. What can I say? <laughs> okay, we're gonna try the oily churro. I just want to say, firstly, quick came at this. This was her, okay? Yes. And the. They're eating up. The we're street. gonna clean up this. So. And this was Max. Didn't finish <laughs> the food, so. Okay, let's try it first without any chocolate. What do you think then? Very nice. Oh it's wow! Very crunchy, obviously on the outside. It's been fried. Inside is quite um, sponge, spongy. Um, very nice. Whoa! <laughs> I mean, after that crap, I think. <laughs> Let's see the chocolate. Oh yeah, I think your taste buds have been affected. I just want to say, get close to the chocolate. If you see around the chocolate from the top, it's hard, but then in the middle. It is soft, quite weird. Mm, crazy. Let's go. What do we think about the chocolate? Chocolate's nice, but it takes over the flavor. Overall, I give it 7.5. Wow. Best so far. Best I so think far. we were very, very... Um, Far from each other. Yeah, this one was off. Well, enjoy. So we think this might be melted Nutella. Not Nutella, see. but um, like chocolate spread. Yeah, because um, if you can see that it's so hard. Yeah, and remember how I dirty that up there. Max managed to dirty up his trousers. So, <laughs> but don't worry, we shall clean the streets. Okay, lastly, we're gonna try the Oreo brownie. Apparently, talking to the lady, she mentioned that there's a brown inside, which is baked. So, let's go and try it. It is quite sticky and heavy. Hold it. Oh gosh, so much sugar. It's so heavy. so wet down here. <laughs> okay, let's try it. My hands are dirty now. I mean, it's just a brownie with mixed Oreo in the mixture, you know. It doesn't look too excited. It tastes of like very uncooked chocolate cake. Mm, I if don't think I'll inside, be trying it. You come inside. It's, it's kind of like cake texture. And mm. I was expecting some crunchiness what i think this is is all the brownies are the same but they just got the different toppings on the top so this one is oreo so it has an oreo on top 
but obviously the Lotus Biscoff has a lot of space. <laughs> but not the, impressed, not I impressed. I don't think the inside changes. Out of 10, the things are like brownie with chocolate chip inside at least. So I'm going to give it a very low 3.5. Hard today. So, what do you think overall? The experience? Can we add everything up? I think the experience is great. Having a walk in there, the Christmas environment, Christmas market, all the lights, all the handmade um, shops that there are. But food-wise, I think there's there's better things. Um, obviously, there's things that we didn't try. But yeah. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Last but not least. To be honest, I don't even want to try it, but I guess I have to because we paid for it. I didn't check any Oreo. <laughs> the Oreo has not been touched. Well, you destroyed it, so. Mm. That's sure, right? It's not bad. It's not bad? How would you would I eat more than two bites? It is very mm. heavy. How would you compare it to other brownies? Very wet. Like it, it so is. wet. And like heavy. Many, it's so wet. Um, Out of ten? A five. A five. Okay, so so what was the best? Ooh, the best. The hot dog like. For me Everything it was the churros, was... then the hot dog and then the brownie and then the crepe <laughs> the crepe was terrible the crepe is i not think even... i went high too high with the three point the three i'm not sure yeah. what i did but yeah well, and thoughts about the overall overall thoughts great experience um was, nice to see all the stuff i'm very had. busy too busy but I'm just gonna eat the Oreo now by itself. <laughs> <laughs> Not the brownie. I have chocolate everywhere, but you know. It was nice. I'm glad we came. Would I get food here again? No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Let's just stick to the restaurants. Alright, well, that's it. <laughs> Rock solid. <laughs> it is. Let me see. Let me see. It is. Oh my god. Rock solid. It's the cold. Frozen. 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 See you in London. <laughs>